AI is going to bring in three kinds of jobs. My take on how the future of jobs will look like in the next three to five years. So this is a million dollar question everybody are asking, and this requires clarity and awareness. I'm gonna try my best to give that. So AI is going to bring in three kinds of jobs. Category one, people who actually create AI. Category two, uh, higher order jobs that are going to create because of AI. Category three is AI users. I'll start with category one. The world just requires 10 to 20,000 of people who are going to create AI. Honestly, it's a tough job and I don't think that so we should have a strategy for it. And the volume of work is also very less. So I'm just going to ignore it. For category two and three, before I explain into the details, I'm a huge fan of the Matrix movie. Imagine what would have got achieved if Agent Smith and Neo started working together. That is the critical juncture we are in, where human beings combined with AI are going to be one such powerful combination. So category two and three are that. We'll come to category two, which is these higher order of jobs. So human beings and agents will be working together. No longer you will have human beings managing other human beings. We are going to get into a world where human beings will be managing both human beings and agents similar. The ability to find that hybrid workforce using human intelligence for the right areas and using AI intelligence for the right area, that higher order of AI jobs will be coming at an abstract level at that. The third category we talked about is AI users. So AI users, as I mentioned before, uh, the each large language model has over a million Einstein brain embedded in them. A person's ability to use that intelligence, tap into the right intelligence to get the desired outcome, that will be the third category that's AI users. So many such things will come into picture. For example, the second category, the higher order of jobs, most of the programming jobs that we know will get into those higher order of jobs. In reality, a project that requires 10 programmers can be done by just one programmer partnered with the right set of agents. That doesn't mean that the number of jobs will go down. The proliferation of use of technology is gonna go up, so the necessity for programmers will go up. And we are gonna compensate that by both human beings and also with agents. That's the second one. The last piece, AI uses anything, like whatever that you do, operational jobs, administrative work, services job, um, anything that you do, um, except uh, like surgeons, um, except like physical work, like chefs, cooking, uh, except those things, everybody has to be AI users. I think this is my take on how the future of jobs will look like in the next three to five years.